What is going on, Road Warriors? High Road Comics here, and you're taking a ride on the HRC, and it's my After the Weekend update. Whosoever watches this channel, if he or she be worthy, shall acquire the knowledge from High Road Comics. So, I didn't have a Monday mail day, but I have something better. I, um, I went to go see Endgame, not once. But twice. I was supposed to see it three times, but I'm gonna go see it in a real IMAX theater. Real. Uh, yeah, one of the 70 millimeter IMAX theaters uh, next weekend, and I'm also gonna go see Rob Liefeld again. Uh, but yes, um, check it out. I got. I'm just gonna show you some of my pickups. Um, I'm not gonna talk any spoilers except for the fact that I'm blown away that uh, 1.2 billion dollar opening weekend for. Avengers Endgame, and that's crazy considering it's a three-hour movie. Yeah, I know AMC played it 24-7 on multiple screens, but damn, that's pretty damn impressive. Congratulations, Marvel, and uh, that's all I'm going to say about that. So, um, yeah, uh, if you haven't seen the movie and you don't want to be spoiled, um, I am going to take a look at some Funko Pops, which uh, could be considered minor spoilers. Um, so unless you already know about the, the line, uh, I would just say maybe catch this video on the rewind later. And I'll, at the end, I'm also going to show you the comic book pickups that I got. Because of the movie. So, actually before I show you my endgame pops, I do want to show you, um, Forky. Toy Story 4 is a GameStop exclusive. Pretty badass. Also from GameStop, it's a Funko Insider Club, Avengers number 463, Hulk in the suit. And my Walmart pickups, I got Ronin. Unfortunately, there's some box damage, but that's okay. Um, I'm gonna put in one of those Funko Pop Protectors, it's better than nothing. I didn't think I'd be able to get this one in the wild. And this is actually the first time that I've seen Walmart Pops that I actually wanted out in the wild. So, lucky me, I guess. I also got Rocket Walmart Exclusive. No box damage. Perfect. They had a few of these, actually. So I'm really surprised that I was able to get these. I'm tired of paying 20 bucks for a uh, Funko Pop on eBay. Alright, uh, so here I'm going to talk some spoilers. Minor spoilers, I guess. Um, yeah. So I got, um, you know what, just, just turn it off if you haven't seen the movie. Just turn it off. Uh, so I didn't get uh, Thor 390, which is the first time that Steve Rogers as the captain picks up uh, Thor's hammer, but I did get Fear Itself Book 7, Found in the Wild. And this one is actually my favorite, um, my favorite one. This is actually the first time Captain America picks up um, Thor's hammer. So let me, let me find the page. I should have had this prepped, but I didn't. Um, check it out. Avengers Assemble. Totally calling on the power of Avenger. Thor's hammer. Just kidding. Yes. Um, got it. Fear itself, book seven. Um, if you want to get technical, it's the first time Captain America holds it. Yes, still Steve Rogers. I do want to get uh, Thor 390 in the future, but there's no way in hell that I'm paying an army play. I did get to grab uh, Avengers 12, which is uh, where Iron Man's holding the Infinity Gauntlet. It's pretty badass. I also got uh, a few copies of this, Captain America, who is the new Captain America. Please, if you have not seen the movie, turn this video off. But uh, this is where Captain America is donned by Sam Wilson, aka Falcon. And then I was able to grab this for under ratio in store, which is crazy. Thanos, 1 in 25, this is a Fino variant. I was going to sell this um, online, but I'm going to keep this because it's going to go great with my uh, Christopher Tyler Black Order variants. 
uh, the all black covers and I am planning on doing a little wall and I'll do a video on that of um, the black covers with that. Thanos and the black co order covers. So yes, um, that's all I got. Um, pretty great weekend. I really did enjoy a game and um, looking forward to seeing it again next week. Please let me know in the comment section below how's your weekend. Um, what did you think about Endgame? And if you think it's uh, worthy of $1.2 billion opening? I definitely do. Well, that's all I got. This is Errol from High Road Comics. Taking the next exit. I'll see you at the next stop.